It was almost a bit of a blur. I look back and it's hard to almost remember it. I was kind of just, everyone was like jumping up around me and I was kind of just sitting there almost like in shock and tr trying to watch the TV and see what they're trying to say about me. But no, it was, it was a very exciting moment for myself and yeah, everyone, everyone around me. Yeah, it was pretty special. Had uh, heaps of mates and obviously family there around there uh, at home. But yes, so my dad to finally get to the days was pretty special and um, yeah, loved every minute of it. So on the third day, I was only me and mum. Um, dad, all the, dad and all the family went back to work, so yeah, I was only me and mum sitting on the couch just watching on my phone, but yeah, it was amazing. Yeah, obviously it was yeah, pretty scary to get picked up on the last day, yeah, in the rookie draft, but yeah, got there in the end and couldn't be, couldn't be more happier. Um, yeah, so coming over was pretty, a, a bit daunting, but mostly excited. More nervous, I reckon, but yeah, finally a bit good to be here. And then... Yeah, it was a little bit nervous, but it was pretty keen to just get stuck into things because we've been waiting a couple of weeks, so yeah, it was good. Yeah, yeah, so I played with um, at East Freer with Taj, which is sick, and then yeah, I knew Jake, uh, Jacob through all the state programs. Played with him actually in Colts for a couple of games back in 2009 before they were drafted, so. I've known Judd and Taj throughout the past few years, and then just knowing that when I'm over here, I have a few friends and a few people that yeah, I can hang out with, so I'm not just yeah, all by myself. Monday was yeah, definitely a bit, of a, a bit of a step up. Today's session was, it's, yeah, it's, it's been very difficult, obviously big transition from your waffle kind of level up to AFL, but today was yeah, a, a lot of fun, more game style kind of stuff. Good to see just the higher level and the higher intensity of the, of the boys out there. Christian Salem, he's brought me in like into the back line very nicely, so yeah, and even Chuck Williams. So. Pretty much everyone, but I think a few of the mids boys like track and vines and all that, pretty special to me. Ben Brown's been a big big help for me. He like just knowing he's been a good, strong key forward for many years now and yeah, he sees that sometimes I do get a little bit lost and don't know what I'm doing, but he's always there to help me out, point me out where I need to go. Or Reese Conger, who's who's also just come on board as um, like player development. Role, he's yeah been a big part in making us feel comfortable. And... Uh, yeah, probably just more my inside game, um, all the stoppage stuff, uh, work with Choco and Ooze and all that to get that down pat. So yeah, I definitely reckon my decision making and clean hands is my strength, and I want to develop um, yeah just my kicking. I reckon kicking efficiency. I think at the moment it would be in the forward line. I don't see why I couldn't transition down to the back line later on if I'm needed to, but like from what they, um, everyone's told me down at the club and what I feel, I think forward's probably the best for me at the moment.